What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of Fishing in a Million. Today is going to be a little bit different. We're going to do an unboxing so you guys stay tuned if you want to see this awesome reel all the way from across the pond overseas. Let's go. All right so surprisingly this got here super fast and I needed some help because man they do things hardcore over there. This reminds me of the staple that was in my leg a while back. Don't play with machetes. And here we go. So we got the peanuts. Even a really nice, awesome pamphlet that gives all the really cool stuff. Jitaka. Let me bust out the old knife. This is the Gerber arm bar. Really cool EDC if you guys are looking for one. So we're going to start off with the super simple stuff. Okay, fishing line. Okay. So we got some Veravas fishing line. Uh, we got some braid right here. And we also have some more braid. All written in Japanese, I think. So yeah, pretty cool. Here we go for the big dog. I'm so excited. The SLX BFS XG by Shimano, guys. Super excited, super thrilled. To get this reel we're going to delve into the whole world of bfs so just wanted to show you guys everything about the box and let's go ahead and get started i'm gonna look oh literally nothing to look at okay sorry guys oh my gosh Oh my gosh, look at that. This is phenomenal looking. Oh my goodness. Really cool like dark smoke gunmetal color with black accent. Nice, you have a lighter spool. I think this spool only weighs about nine grams. A BFS reel, um, this is to take us into the realm of throwing tiny little stuff efficiently. So anyways, we're, um, what are you doing? I think she wants to come say hi. Come Up. Look at this big puppy. You see the reel? You see the reel? What's this? Hmm? Okay. All right. Bye. See you later. Here's your I almost forgot to mention that this does have a drag clicker. So, uh, one of the things I love about spinning is to hear that noise when they're taking your line. Uh, but bait casters never have that. It's like a doot, 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 doot. it's just like pulling the line. But uh, this is really cool. You can hear this. Are you ready? Oh yeah. So uh, one of the uh, things about this is it only has a about 7.8 pound drag, so around eight pound drag. Uh, which is plenty. Um, most of the time we're not catching fish um, too much over 10 pounds. I think one of the biggest fish I've caught on the channel uh, was a Jack Crevel and um, that thing that thing wasn't getting turned for nothing and um, I just let the drag do the work. So um, most of the time you know we're catching fish between you know three to five pounds. This is uh, made by Shimano. Um, I did get it in the left hand because I really like the fact that you can click and reel and you don't have to switch hands. Anyways, this is the XG model, so that means it has the extra gear. Uh, this is going to be an 8.2 gear ratio. Uh, the handle is a little bit smaller than your normal 100 millimeter handle. Your basic stuff here, we have a drag, drag star, we got our reel uh, handle. Uh, we got our clicker, very nice tactile clicker. Um, we have our little, here we go, and twist it clockwise, and here it comes. Here it comes off, your magnets there on the side, and here comes the spool, comes on out, very nice, very light spool. Um, it's a very shallow spool, so as you can tell, it's not going to hold a ton of line. That's why I got some super skinny line that we're going to put on it. And that'll probably give me around 100 yards, maybe 120 yards, uh, which would be plenty. Um, the other thing about this is um, one of the reasons why I got this is because 
the magnesium reels are prone to corrode a little bit more so than this so that's why i went with this um, on the website it does say that it is salt water ready so that's really cool so we're going to be uh, busting this guy out in salt water and i'm super super excited uh, to be doing that uh, the guys at murky water are going to be making a rod to go with this so it's going to be super awesome uh, i've been talking to jacob about it it's going to be an ultralight rod it's going to throw the super tiny stuff like the 1 16th uh, 1 8th and below like a 1 32nd um, that's getting down to a gram um, uh, but let, let me uh, let me know down in the comments if you guys would like to see uh, some casting reviews on this uh, with this reel. I'm definitely going to be fishing with it um, in the channel. So I have this line that I'm thinking about throwing on there as well. It's in the 0.8 gom, which is 16.7 pounds. And then we also have some 10 pound fluorocarbon shock leader. So... Um, Kind of got an array of stuff. Um, I'm thinking I'm going to put this on if I ever go to uh, Tennessee or fish for some uh, trout up there in the rivers. Uh, but for the most part, I'll be throwing one of these two um, on here. Um, maybe I'll see which one is most aesthetically pleasing. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to this unboxing. If you guys are interested in any of this stuff here, go ahead and smack a like and hit that subscribe button. We do a lot of uh, really cool stuff here on the channel, saltwater fishing, kayak fishing, wade fishing, from freshwater to saltwater. Um, so join us uh, join us on the journey. Uh, if you guys would like to support this channel, uh, we got Fishing in Milligan shirts, we got a brand new design. Uh, go, go ahead and go over to fishinginmilligan.com um, or shoot me an email at fishinginmilligan at gmail.com and uh, just let me know what you guys would be interested and possibly getting. All right, guys. Murky water rods, about a seven foot light action, and I got it with the Shimano BFS SLX. Check this out. It's like the Energizer Bunny, guys. Still.